Hi guys, this is Nick Marco from Temperance, and we are here to give you some information about the new record, which is called Diamante, and it will be out in November for Not Now Record. We have been working on this record quite a lot. We have some more tracks than regular 10 tracks. Yes. Track 12, is, 12 yeah. tracks. 12 tracks plus Japanese bonus <laughs> track. <laughs> <laughs> But the record starts with Pure Life and Folds. I think it is one of the most epic track we ever done, ever done before. Epic means it is happy, but also epic, right? <laughs> It's both, a happy both, track. Both. <laughs> And the funny thing is, it is one of the track uh, we did together. Mm -hmm. Basically, it starts for uh, as your song. Yeah, it started as we did yeah. something together. And I think we, we did a nice we're, job. We're, yeah. we're yes. satisfied with our song. <laughs> we're happy with what we did. No, it's it's really happy. It's majestic. It's intense. It's strong. It's fast. Uh, the feeling that I that I have all the time that I listen to this song is that it's the perfect song to put on uh, while you are driving on a highway, you know, really fast. And it's somehow engaging. It's really uh, taking you into this journey that begins from the very first note with this huge explosion and lasts till the acoustic part in the end, yes. which is an addition that you decided to do and I was like oh my god this is amazing let's let's do it yes yes but we think that is the best way to to promote Diamante yeah and also to begin to, to begin make it, to this, make it begin, this new yeah. path with Diamante the second track is called Breaking the Rules of Heavy Metal And this is a song that we've been working on before the entire... We started to work on the entire record. It was not meant to be in Diamante, but then in the end we decided to keep it for the record too. Yes, because we're supposed to release this song in the middle of the pandemic, just mm -hmm. to release something new. But at, at the end we decided to include it in Diamante. I think it's the heaviest song, the heaviest ever. song mm -hmm. we did for Diamante, but maybe in general, in general, probably. Maybe in general, in general yes. probably. For sure it's like the most old style mm. track because, yes i mean we were even unsure if we wanted to have some keyboards in it ah, in yes. the very beginning and the basic idea of breaking the rules of big metal had no keyboards at all we want to have we wanted to have just a heavy guitar riffing mm -hmm. in the style of trash metal <laughs> yes see that some trash vibes and we wanted to be like a super pure heavy metal track but of course with our classical classic trademarks As for the chorus, yeah, the chorus because is super temperance, super temperance. But then in the end, when we were in the middle of the pandemic and we didn't know if we would have released the album on that specific date, on that other specific date, we just thought it over with the label, with Napalm, and all together we decided to include the song in the mind. But other funny fact, the video clip that will be released now. I mean, we are recording this video the day before the release <laughs> of the <laughs> Rules of Heavy Metal, but you will have seen the video clip after this. After this. Luckily. Luckily. <laughs> And that video clip, we filmed it last year. Yes. More one, than one year ago. More than one year ago. The third track of the album is the title track, and it is, of course, Diamante. Diamante. Which is the first song with this lineup with an Italian chorus. Mm -hmm. It's our first Italian experiment. A lot of you have been asking for a song for a long Italian. time. For a long time, we've been receiving hundreds of thousands of emails with people <laughs> telling us, every day, "Can you please <laughs> sing a song in Italian?" No, jokes apart, we we we've been receiving some requests, and it was nice to do this experiment to finally unleash yes, our it language. was an experiment but the good thing in my opinion is uh, the connection the connections between Diamante and uh, the albums we did before because as, as you as you know uh, Diamante is diamonds of course in English we thought about some connection with of Jupiter moons because on Jupiter the, the planet I mean there is a sort of uh, rain rain diamond. with diamond 
actually the chorus begins with this sentence uh, in, yes. in Italian, of course, Giovano Diamanti. Also because right now I'm processing, but they should know that if they go on Spotify, they won't just find the Not Italian so version of yes. Diamanti, but there will be also more versions of Diamanti with the chorus. Other four in. versions. Of course, we have Italian, then we have English, English, French, Spanish, and Dutch and German. And this was so amazing in the studio because we had some friends helping us with the translation, of course, which we want uh, to say thanks to. Uh, but then the funny part was <laughs> going behind the microphone in the studio and singing in a language Crazy. which we don't really speak. <laughs> so during the French version, we were like trying to be as accurate as possible. In the German version, we did the same and everything was so different. Everything sounded oh, yes. so different, but it was such uh, a huge moment of fun. We enjoyed a lot. Yeah, it was super funny.